Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here for another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to show you guys how to install printer driver software without the need for any CDs or DVDs that might have come along with your printer. So this is a pretty quick tutorial and this is going to cover just one of different ways to download and install printer driver software. So we're going to jump into it and we're going to start by opening up the start menu. And this process should be pretty similar if you're running any modern version of Windows. And you want to type in printer. And the best match that comes up should say devices and printers directly above control panel. You want to left click to open that up. And now up here at the top, you want to left click on this add a printer button. So sometimes I would recommend that you actually have your printer already plugged into your computer or you have your printer on at this time. And often it will pick it up if you have a wireless printer, but we're going to go through a couple of different ways if this is not going to be available for you guys. So we're going to just go with it. And it says no devices found. However, if any devices are populating in this list, you want to click on them and then select next. However, if you do not have one, we're going to move on to the next step, which would be to select the printer that I want isn't listed. So left click on that. So now if you had an older printer, you could just click on this option. My printer is a little older, help me find it. So perhaps you were upgrading this version of Windows from Windows 7 to Windows 10, and you wanted to select that. I would select next at that point. If you're trying to add a brand new printer, you could also select add a local printer or network printer with manual settings. It's probably your good option right down there, so I'd recommend you try that. And then select next. And then under use an existing port, just keep that default the LPT1 printer port and then select next. And now at this point you have the option I would recommend to find out what the exact printer you're running. So if you're running a Brother Canon Dell printer, if you left click on the manufacturer's name, you can see a wide variety of brands come up on the right side here and different model series and class drivers should be available. So you want to make sure you select the correct manufacturer on the left side here. And you see there's quite a few that are listed so there's a scroller you can scroll down. And you just want to select the printer. And then underneath printers on the right side, you want to select the specific printer. And then select next, add the printer name. And this will install the printer driver software on your computer. And then you click on finish. And this should cover most popular printers that you have available. And keep in mind, if yours is not listed in that list for the manufacturers, do not worry. You can always go online to that specific printer manufacturer's website, and they will have driver software that you can download in a automatic run tool more than likely and then you just download the tool and it will install the driver software automatically so it's pretty convenient and they make it pretty straightforward for most computer users but I wanted to make a brief tutorial just highlighting a quick way to do it without really needing to go get complicated with going online and whatnot but I do hope I was able to help you guys out and as always thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next tutorial goodbye